Hi y'all, it's me. I just have a small haul I'd like to share with you from various places. I'll explain as I go along. Um, the first thing I got in was from Stampin' Up. I ordered a couple of items online from them and I really like the look of the 3D embossing folders if you haven't seen them. Um, Tim Holtz makes some and I'm sure other companies make them as well. Um, this one is called uh, Lace. And it was, it's one of the ones from Stamping Up. And as I said, it's a 3D um, embossing folder. So you get a better impression than just on the regular um, embossing folders. And I made a sample so you could see it. Look how beautiful that is. So that's a sample of that embossing folder. And then I got a second one. And I used this on one of the tiny totes that I uploaded yesterday. It's on the pink and polka dot one that one and this one is called country floral and it doesn't look like much in the picture but it sure is beautiful when you when you use it oh look at that is that just it's lovely absolutely beautiful I mean for a card base or whatever this is just gorgeous so anyhow those are from stamping up uh, from Dollar Tree I just wanted to show you these I buy these from them when they have them in store but just a reminder that if you can't find stuff in store, you can order online. The problem is with online ordering with um, Dollar Tree is you have to buy the quantity that they come in in a box. So if you don't want that many, then you got to wait for it to come to store. However, these are something I use all the time. Um, I've been buying them for quite a while. They're these little tiny uh, acrylic totes. You know, for a dollar, you can't go wrong. They're relatively sturdy. Um, I don't have any problems with anything breaking as of yet, and I've been using them, as I said, for quite some time. Um, they, If you go on their website uh, to order, they're under, just put in organizer, and it'll come up um, there. But they're super fun and so many uses for those, so I wanted to share that with you. Um, the next thing is I got uh, on Instagram, I saw... Mommy Loves Gigi, she showed these that were at Walmart, and I just had to go out and try to get them when I was at Walmart buying some groceries yesterday, and they happened to have them. There's a, an ice cream cone-shaped one and a unicorn, and basically these are just filled with tiny beads that, not really that tiny, I mean, they're they're small, but not teensy. But anyway, you get a gazillion in there, so... I just thought that was really cute, and they run about six bucks if you're looking. They were on a cardboard display towards an end cap at my store. I don't know how it would be in yours. Um, anyhow, I went over to Tuesday morning. I've been waiting for my store to reopen. They've been closed, of course, this whole time and just barely reopened yesterday. I knew they weren't going to have any new stuff in store because they just opened. So, um, <clears throat> in fact, they told me that the trucks were out back and they had to unload them all so I'll go back again at some point but what I did find I wanted to share with you uh, they had these tiny straws and what I like about them is let's see these are small versions so they measure like five and three quarters high and they're pretty sturdy little straws for being you know little they're very sturdy so um, I picked these two up and they were $1.99 those were in the gift wrap section actually uh, I found these in the gift wrap section as well. And yes, you can make your own, but these were so cute already because they already had the grommets in them and, you know, they're already decorated. You can use these for anything because they're pretty, pretty simple, plain. So you get, um, let's see, you get 24, six of each design. So I thought that was a great deal. So I picked those up. Uh, I found a Bow Bunny stamp that I liked, so I went ahead and got this one. I just love that it's a background and you get all those beautiful little butterflies everywhere. $2.99 for that one. I found this, which is not anything new. It's um, from Merry Days, but they did have quite a bit of Merry Days in this time. I don't know why. Maybe they got it right before they closed or and I didn't see it. I'm not sure. But this one's just a tag kit, and I don't think I have this in my... Mary Day's collection of stuff, so I picked that one up. I found a die, which is so cute. It's a sewing machine with a thread spool and a thimble. This was $4.99, and it's a pretty decent size. I thought it would be super cute to use in projects. So I picked that one up. 
Um, as far as paper goes, I did pick up two things, and um, I got the Sunny Days. I got the Project Pad. Now, I know they sell these in Joann's, but not at my Joann's. My Joann's sucks. It doesn't have anything ever, <laughs> ever that all of y'all show. Um, but I, I have the collection Sunny Days from Maggie Holmes, and I do think I've either seen this or I have one. I haven't checked, but what I like about the Project Pad is you get the coordinating papers, then you get, you know, of course, some of the sheets from the collection, the cut-aparts, and then you get glitter paper, you get, there's some more of the paper there, these are alphabet stickers that come in the collection pad, these are also stickers that you get, so it's a great deal for, um, you know, having a bunch of stuff in a collection, so I picked that up, but what I went for, and I know this is going to be funny, but before they closed, I remembered that they had a pack of this in the store, and I didn't pick it up then, and so I was going, I hope it's there when I go back. And I had to do a little digging, but I did find it, and it was the only one that they had. And I know you've seen them before, but they're these acetate sheets. And what I was really excited about was that they were um, they're different colors, and with all those little totes coming out and all the things made with acetate I thought it would be nice to have the colored acetate and such a great price so this one you get polka dots and stripes in in each color uh, that's in here so you get the yellow oops sorry you get there's that yellow there that green color there's pink and then purple so I was so excited that they still had it and that I even remember that's how well I know my my Tuesday morning supply. And then finally, the last thing to share with you, um, their Easter stuff in my store is 80% off. And I saw this before Easter and I was like, I want it, but I didn't want to spend $25 for it. And it's kind of large. Let me see if I even can get them in here. Here, I'm going to pick up my, see if I can pick up my phone a little. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this guy. Oh, isn't that cute? He is so cute, and I'm not big on this kind of stuff normally, but for some reason, this one just appealed to me, and it was 80% off, and that means I paid $5 for it, so you can't go wrong for $5, and like I said, all their stuff in the in their section of Easter was off, but it is just darling. Look at the hat. I'm kind of showing you the side view. <laughs> Super cute, so he's going to decorate in my craft room yay <laughs> anyway thank you so much for spending a few minutes with me and until next time do what makes you happy bye for now